Today, of course, one of the sweetest days of the year. It's Dairy Queen Miracle Treat Day. A dollar from every blizzard sold today will benefit the Sanford Children's Hospital. Mark Brim has been at the uh, Dairy Queen on Minnesota Avenue here in Sioux Falls all morning long, and let's send it back out to him. Mark. Hey, good morning, Thor. That's right. We're at the Dairy Queen Minnesota Avenue here in Sioux Falls. It is Miracle Treat Day. They're already open. Your breakfast plans are solved. Head here this morning. Thousands of blizzards going to be sold throughout the day. A dollar from each blizzard purchase goes to Sanford Children's Hospital. That stays right here in our community, benefits the children in our community. And joining me this morning, Melissa, Lena, Thank you so much for getting up early and joining us. And, and Melissa, just tell me a little bit about just your the experience that's had and the significant the experience you guys have had and uh, the significance of a day like this. Yes. Yeah, so Miracle Treat Day is a big day in our house. Everybody, nobody can argue with starting breakfast with ice cream, huh? Starting the day off. And we, uh, but for us, you know, we are frequent flyers at the Sanford Children's Hospital. And for us, this is such an important day because. For us families, when we're sitting inpatient in a hospital and you don't have time to go and run and get something to eat, it's the meals that that the Children's Miracle Network covers for us. It's the support we get from the community that that Chanford Children's Miracle Network has really brought to um, to our lives. and. It's honestly, it's been a life-changing program for us. It's gotten us equipment that we would have otherwise had to pay for out of our own pocket um, that insurance doesn't always cover. And it's these events that really give these kids a huge opportunity at life for all of the, all of the things that they have to go through and just to have a little day so that we can celebrate them and get a sweet treat. And it is a great reminder, the importance of that. And, and tell us about Lena, when I see right now, is a happy, playful kid with, of course, the typical injury to the knee from playing outside. But uh, tell us a little about, uh, about uh, Lena. So Lena was born 10 weeks early, and she had to get a pacemaker right after birth um, because her heart just wasn't sending proper electrical signals. And she's really, um, from the beginning, a lot of her doctors say, wow, you'd never guess that here she is now riding a bike and doing all the things that other kids do. And yeah, she's, she's thriving. And honestly, we wouldn't be able to thrive without Sanford Children's and Children's Miracle Network. These doctors and the resources we have here are next to none. That is wonderful. And Lena, m most importantly, the most important question, what are you going to have for breakfast? What kind of ice cream are you going to get this morning? Onion. Oreo. Oreo. Good <laughs> choice. Maybe you'll get the one I made a little bit ago. Who knows? <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us thank this you. morning. It's Miracle Treat Day and just a great reminder of just the value of getting out there, enjoying the fact you can get a blizzard and you have a good excuse to get one today. We're at the Dairy Queen here on Minnesota Avenue and uh, Dairy Queens throughout the community. We're actually going to be checking back in coming up in the nine o'clock hour with Bailey and Aaron. We're going to be at the Dairy Queen on 57th. And uh, we'll check back in with you in a little bit. In the meantime, I'll send it back to you guys in the studio. All right. Hey, Mark, an Oreo Blizzard sounds great for breakfast. Go out, help kids like Lena and all the others. A portion of the proceeds from every Blizzard sold. In some locations, all the proceeds go to help the Children's Miracle Network and the uh, Sanford Children's Hospital. 31 different Dairy Queens in Iowa and Minnesota taking part in that today.